Hi, it's me, Tree. Um, I have an Art Snaps box. One of the, the larger ones to um, crack open and show you because everything is contact, contact, content, and I am avoiding finishing my art talk for tomorrow because, hi, because that's something I do is I try and stab myself. Open. Hello. Hello, little love. Ariel coming to check on me. Such a tiny bean. Alrighty. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Let me just say, I love these, like, little bags that they have in there. It's like, it just, it's like, you know, a nice little bag you can shove things in. I'm weird that way. Alright, so. First things the first. We have a graphics mark marker pad because the big ones come with strata and i think last month was the big honkin thing of graphics markers so i they go together i guess accidentally incidentally open the bag dump it all out because it's fun Oof. our snack of the month is a watermelon air, airhead which i like airheads but i don't like watermelon eric do you like watermelon Give it to Eric. Tombow ABT Pro alcohol based markers in greens. A green tone thing. Cool. Dual tip marker, brush tip, and chisel tip. Do 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 do. Break into the tissue paper. The sticker of the month for the month. Yay. Ooh, ooh, aren't we pretty? <clears throat> Very pretty. Mechanical pencil, blue and shiny and... Yes, can I help you? Can I help you, little friend? You're closer than me. Ah, you're closer than me. <laughs> this is so in my wheelhouse. Um, uh, I'm not even sure how to say it. Kokoryo, um... Like brush marker. I want to say I have one of these. It's Kuretake. Everything's Kuretake, I swear. Um, I swear I have one of these. But this one's. This one has llamas on it. <laughs> Which, let me tell you how much I love that. Yeah, I, I have one of these. Um, it's in a blue color, but it, llamas and cacti, and it's a really pretty green. I don't know why I'm so excited about the llamas and the cacti, but I am. Are you a brush pen? Do you have ink in you? I, it looks like it is a sepia inked brush pen. Ooh, ooh, that, that's exciting. And, um, another one of the... Tombos, but in this kind of like nice periwinkle because with the the big honkin uh box you get um what's in the smaller box as well as other stuff so that's why there's like a little redundancy going on here with things so all right yes i'm going to play with the tissue paper don't mind me so that is the unboxing part um, I'm gonna have to do, 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 come back and do, um, my brain is mush, uh, and do, like, swatching and things, <laughs> there we go, I f found the words, uh, do the swatching and things, um, a little bit later, because I, it's hard to do it when you're looking at me. Tombow uh, Pro Alcohol Based Marker. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Hello. W was Ariel trying to be my friend? <laughs> uh, Kurataki Zig Kikoro Letter Pen Pentel Arts Color Brush Pen. 
Pentel Graph Gear 300 mechanical pencil in 0.7 millimeter Tombow ABT Pro alcohol based markers set of five in this really nice green set. And Marabou graphics marker paper pad. Alright, there we go. I will be back later with swatches and things. Yay! Yay! Be good. Do do good. Be kind. Be brave. Courage. I will be back. Okay, so this is the rest of the um, the art snacks unboxing. Um, so the first thing we have is um, it's a Graph Gear 300 point seven um, mechanical pencil, clicky pencil. Um, I don't really use these that often, but we're gonna do it here. I prefer drawing with colored pencils, and we're doing this on the the Marabu Graphics marker paper, which is going to be good for the alcohol-based markers, but is going to be not good for the sepia pen. Um, but we're just going to draw ourselves a little a Montessera plant. Quickly, since everyone is obsessed with these little friends, and it's just super quick. Not really a thing I draw that often, but there we go. So then we're going to move into um, the Tombow. Uh, ABT Pro alcohol based markers, which I seem to have accidentally left one um, open a little too much and it got kind of dry. So we're contending with that. Always remember that your caps need to go on good, kids. And just do some loose color work. I do wonder if I got kind of a beat up pack because they just seem a little dry, but then again, that might just be how Tombow alcohol markers are. I don't have any besides these. I use like their tip, their usual markers, which are um, water soluble. So. <laughs> This could be part of the problem, or it could just be that some of them got really dried out. Because this one feels juicy. But yeah, just doing a lot of like quick work today. Um, because they're alcohol based, they don't mix very well, which, you know, that's fair. Unless you have, like, a blender. I, I, I honestly find with alcohol-based markers that if you use them on Bristol board, you can get some more, like, watercolor blending going on because marker paper is kind of made not to let them do that. And I'm weird, I also prefer having some texture going on. Um, and marker paper is hot, severe hot press, so it's super slick. This is the one that I've managed to, like, leave open somehow, so, you know. Though it seems to do, be doing slightly better on the marker paper, so. 
That's good to know. And it's like the, the Art Snacks Plus box this month came with like this five pack. If you got the usual Art Snacks, you got one. And my one was this blue, which is nice. It's kind of a periwinkle. Just use it to put in some of our, our background space, our ground. Though I think I managed to dry this one out somehow too. This may not have been my month with alcohol markers. And you know, that's the chance you take with this kind of thing, is that sometimes, well, and buying any art supplies, sometimes they're just dried out for some reason and you don't know why. Um, the other thing that came in the box was this um, letter pen Kukoiro pen that has llamas and cacti on it, which made me really happy. So we're going to use it to put some black line work in. Just a little. This is me being super gestural and super sketchy. Which is something that usually only shows up in my sketchbook. So hello, welcome to something that is my sketchbook without being my sketchbook, sort of. I just find it much easier for me to be a looser gestural uh, person in uh, do, 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 do. what's that called? Sketchbook. Um, a thing to remember about this is that this is water soluble, which I didn't realize when I was doing something else earlier. So that's good to know. Um, but yes, there you go. That 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 is all the stuff that works on the graphics um, marker paper. Um, you can see where I did some swatching of things earlier. That was the sepia pen, pen which won't work on this. Um, so for the other, for to show the sepia thing, I'm using the uh, Fabriano Mixed Media thing uh, pa pad, which came in Marches. Um, Arts Next Plus box. Um, ignore the, the the blood orange there but it's um, basically a water pen that's filled with sepia ink that is water soluble and we'll just do a big old swatch here for you to see and we'll do a swatch of the black too as well and plus you can see that like how fine that like tip is on that pen and there we go and my, my trusty water pen which actually came out of an art snacks box I think but like I said this bleeds out it actually makes a really lovely gray and the sepia kind of just goes and goes and goes and becomes lovely and soft and then you kind of can get them together and make some nice stone colors so there you go there is um the art snacks Eep. art snacks plus like swatchy dry thing all right, thank you for hanging with me. I know that I do weird things on here. Um, so do good, be kind, be brave, encourage.